Hey, this is Mike Patriot coming to you guys with a another box review. Uh, my my wife also got me this one for uh, Valentine's Day. I saw reviews on it before. I, I really have no idea what's in it. I know it's survival gear and other such items. But let's figure out what's in it. All right it up pretty good. Well, it looks like first of all you got a whole bunch of this cardboard crap. Probably good for starting a fire, but it's their shipping stuff. Oh, the first one. Oh, look at that. That'll be good to put on there. Uh, the box prices. The basic, 25 bucks. It's a $48 value, the advanced 50, it's a $117 value, the Pro is a $100, value, and the uh, Pro Plus, well, it looks like you get a survival knife with it, is a $407 value. There's that for everybody to look at. Uh, for starters, you get a little I guess it tells you an app that you can download. I'll have to check that out later. All right, the first little item in here. Mini Inferno. Oh, yeah. Those are going to be little, uh, probably something like a Vaseline-soaked wafer for starting a fire. Really not feeling like demonstrating inside the house because I don't want to get in trouble for that. I'm good enough at starting fires in here. Uh, what do we have here? Some kind of a funky shaped tent post. Got, and they keep coming out of the box. Got four of those little guys. That means there's probably something in here to go along with it. You got a lighter holder. Looks like it is completely waterproof, reusable, so you put a Bic lighter in there. Bic Classic. It's got a gas lock so you don't burn your thumbs. That's pretty cool. ExoTac. Alright, the next item. This will really help on my kayak. Insect repellent. That is good stuff. It is, looks like it has no D, and it will not harm gear or equipment. That's at least what it says. Uh, don't spray it in your eyes and don't swallow it. Made local in Florida. Look at that. I like that. All right, another one. We got a cedar fire starter. A little wafer, probably to go along with these tiny wafers right there. And here we go, a little knife spoon fork plastic deal. I don't know how durable that knife is going to be, but hey, if you're out in the woods and uh, you only want to carry one item, there you go. That'll work. The spoon's decent size. The fork is uh, good enough, but it kind of not work to hold something with a fork and be able to cut it because you got it all in one. But for survival, make do with what you got. All right, another one. It's a weekend sample pack of Murphy's Mosquito Candle. Let's see what the oh, little like tea light candles and little incense stick looking deals. Hmm. Smells like citronella. That's not bad. I can deal with that. It smells a lot better than deep. All right. Look at that. More of that cardboard stuff. No, here's the last box. But let's see what other paperwork we got. This is. Oh, a free Ready Man membership. 
I'll have to look into that. I have no idea what any of this is, so we'll have to look into it. Oh, it's a speed clinch. That's what these tent stakes are. So you can tie a rope onto it. I guess you run the rope through the middle, run it out. In here, out here, around here. And supposedly it ties it up. We will see. I have to go camping so I can try it out. The uh, Mini Inferno from SelfRelianceOutfitters.com. Look at that, 20% off. There's a code for you guys if you want to use it. Mini Fire. These tiny little wafers right here. You get. What are you getting there? You get six of them. That's not bad. You can probably do the same thing with your wife's makeup pad, soak it in Vaseline and stick them in a jar when you want to refill it. Alright, the last item in a big white box. Oh, I'm not sure what it is. It looks like a tent, but it's not a tent, it's hard. It is. A cooking set. Here's your little pot. It's a what is that? That's a 24 ounce pot. That's pretty good. Use it over the stove. Uh, I'm sure I'll figure this out. Looks like you set that down like so. I'm trying to open this all up. make survival gear easy to open. Good thing it's not life or death that you cook yourself a meal. Alright, so there you clip it on like so. Put that in there. Probably you don't want to put the plastic in there. And then you got this little deal right here with a, I'm guessing it's a Oh yeah. I don't know if I should open it. Okay, it's empty. So you put uh, probably rubbing alcohol in there. And you'll get a... I'm going to say for a can that size, you'll probably get a good two hours of burn time. So save some of that vodka. Don't drink it all. Use it to cook your food. Here's another plate for this thing if you don't want the uh you know, maybe it isn't a plate i'm not sure where that goes then i'm gonna have to look at the directions except for they didn't give me any for that one so i'm gonna have to play with it and figure it out that's pretty cool right there here's a little bowl flip out the handle oh, that's probably what it's for right there fry yourself up an egg this one you can boil some water, cook some soup. Well, that's about it. I'm going to have to give this stuff a shot and see what I like, see what I don't like. Again, this is the uh, Battle Box. The 49... Where is this? Oh, uh, the Advance. The $49 box. Well, I guess it says on here what it, what, can, what it came with. The camp stove, this one right here, uh, MSRP of 60 uh, We'll see if it's worth 60 because that's kind of uh, cheap looking, but it seems pretty sturdy. Well, I'll give it a shot, and I'll get back to you guys. Have a good day. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment.